everybody. Yep, yep. Here we are. We on 59. We headed south. We're here in Alabama. No, we haven't made it to 459. We're 57 miles from 459. And uh, yeah, we're gonna stop over in Tuscaloosa. I don't know if we stopping there for today or we just stopping for a break, but I know we are stopping in Tuscaloosa. And we may be going on from there, but we'll see. Yep, yep. We up here in the hilly country, or we out here in the hilly country, yes sir. Got to pull off this exit here. I got to check the computer and see whether I'm needing a 30 minute break or if that's two and a half hours that I got left for today. I think that's just for my first aid. Did you get in that service station with your truck or no? Hey folks, I just looked over my computer earlier when I thought I had a 30 minute break out of the way. I left right at 30 minutes, well. Normally, I give it a 31 or 32 before I take off. But this time I left right at 30, and I guess I jumped the gun because according to the computer, it was only 29 minutes. Which is showed 30 minutes on the timer, but I don't know. Yep, yep, 24 miles folks. We're going to be out back on I-20. Yeah, yeah. And then it's drugging up from there all the way across, stay on 20. Why is Oh, look at the bear. The bear got him somebody. Yep, yep. Right underneath or right here in between 
to take us off and put us right back on. They have done that before, but. I mean, where's all these people? Look at these people coming up the right side. They think they're special. We're all going to the same place. thought they were special coming up the ride everybody's going off the exit everybody so I guess their time is more valuable than anybody else's oh you gotta love this shit yeah I said something on the radio about that and then the guy behind me went over there blocked the lane. Uh, anywho. Alright. Now I'll get back with y'all when I figure out what's going on. Well, it's been about five minutes since I stopped recording. Now I'm back. And y'all see how far I got. <laughs> Not very far. Still ain't got off the exit. But, yeah. Still don't see nothing. So, yeah, I don't know what they got us doing because it ain't getting off and getting right back on. Oh, this is just great. Just what I need. go up here, go to the end, turn left, and then come back out MFK Junior Road, the way it looks. Yeah, got much of a choice. That's the way we're going. Look, folks, where I'm at on fuel. Yeah. And from right here, if I was on the interstate, it's 80 miles. 80 miles to the fuel stop. Which I'm okay. But I'm cutting it close. See, my gauge is floating, so really, I don't know. I, I might have a quarter tank or just a little less than a quarter. But yeah, it's gotten it close. Uh, anywho. Yeah, I'll see what everybody's doing. Well, that's what I got to do too. should have stayed back there. And they even got a truck blocking the on ramp. So you can't do a U turn and get right back on. <laughs> I'm sure that's probably what a lot of people would have done. Back down a little bit. Yep, yep. Back here on these old 
pastures. Oh, God, I'm having flashbacks. Of you. Well, no, can't say flashbacks yesterday because I didn't ever sit in traffic like this yesterday. I was on back roads all day yesterday, but not in traffic. This is ridiculous. Well, folks, it's been over an hour. I still ain't made it back to the interstate. Still on the back roads. I sit still, I mean completely still with the brakes locked for about 30 minutes. And now we're moving at four miles an hour. And I got very little fuel. Yeah, very little fuel. And still got 90 miles to get there. To get fuel. Yeah, buddy. Well, well, well. Still ain't made it back to the big road. Still moseying along here at a high rate of slow speed. Yeah. Oh my lord. Oh man. Now I'm getting on this hill and this the fuel is running backwards. It's showing that I'm out of fuel. I can't sit on the side of this too long. Oh no, I can't sit on the side of this bridge too long. I'm too out of fuel. That's pretty down there. That's what I'm talking about, living down there. That would be perfect. Hell yeah. Oh, and there's some water here too. Yeah, buddy, we crossing over some water here. I didn't know if this was just a ravine that they was building a bridge over or there was water here or what it was. Yeah, some sort of river. Yeah, yeah. Anywho, well, now they moving. Hopefully, they'll keep on moving. Man, this ain't good. This ain't good. I don't like being this low on fuel. Oh. Here we go, folks. Oh, there's the tow truck right there. It's got the trailer. Yeah, so they'll be opening the interstate up here soon. They got the tow truck here off the exit. Good looking unit there, too. Ooh, boy. Yeah, yeah. All right, folks. There we go. Back on the big road. 85 miles to go to get the fuel. We're going to be cutting her close. All right, folks. All right. Welcome to Mississippi. Yep, yep. We made it into Mississippi. We got 23 miles to get to the fuel stop. I got that much fuel. None. I'm hoping once you get down to E, you're, you still got some. That's <laughs> what I'm hoping. But anyhow. Oh. Uh, been a, a stressful ass last 40 50 miles but it is what it is got the green light so I ain't gotta worry about stopping so let's go all right folks all right we're two miles from our exit so we're getting there yep yep I'm damn sure push the limits on this bitch this time. We ain't there yet though, so I need to hush. If we can pull up to a pump, I don't feel safe. Yeah. That's when I feel safe when I pull up to that pump. But anywho, yeah, well. Still a couple miles. I don't know why my GPS it I had it set for this truck stop here and it wants me to go past it to come back to it. I don't understand that. I don't get it. Yeah, yeah, but oh well. 
I know I ain't doing that, so no matter what it says. Yeah. Anywho, not this next exit, but the, the second one coming up. We got this one and then one more. That'll be mine. Uh -huh. Oh, Barn Hills. Yeah, I ain't heard of them. Well, it's closed just like every other Barn Hills, but yeah. Ain't seen that in a long time. This golden crowd took over the market. Barn Hills has been shut down. All right, all right, folks. We made it off the exit. Yeah, I'm holding the phone because the, the, the magnet that was stuck to the back done got hot and the glue done come undone. So I'm going to have to get a new plate to put on the back of my phone. But for right now, I got to get across here. And we have made it across there. Yep. Once we get in the truck stop, I'll be happy. Just getting in there. Yep, yep. Yep, but we made it to the truck stop. Uh, that's a plus. Well, <laughs> I need to get to a pump. Yep. Back with Look at a classic XL, folks. He's even got a, a gorilla on there, the grape ape. That's right, that's right. I love it. That's what I'm talking about. All right, folks, I got my fuel. I got all got out of there. Now we uh, we're six miles from stopping where we plan on stopping for tonight. I was going to stop back there, but I was like, nah, I'll go a little bit further, and yeah, I got 15 minutes left on my clock, and got six miles till I'm stopping, so, yep, yep, it looks like it's wanting to rain here anyways, so I might rather be stopped before the rain starts. My truck is still somewhat clean. Should be. It got washed twice yesterday, but anyhow. Yep, yep. I'll get back with y'all here in a bit. All right, all right. I got two miles, two miles, and I gotta get past the truck in two miles. I don't know if I can. I see the exit coming up. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pass them in time. I might be able to. Cutting 
they close. Alright. She flashed a lot of me let me in. What a deal, what a deal. Order for your miles. Take exit 96 on the right toward Lake. Yep, yep. We are. We at the Lowe's. Yep, yep. And we're gonna. Yeah. I'm gonna pull through. And go around to where I'm lined up the right way to park. But all the friggin' pumps are taken. Yes, sir. Look at that two Peter builds. Yep, yep. Old school and new school. Alright, alright, folks. Now it's time for me to get up out of this truck stop. I got to pull around there to the pump so I can go in and get my drink and all, and then I got to get up out of here. It is 10 minutes to 5, so yeah, it's a little later than what I wanted it to be, but it's all right. It's all good. Uh, people just park anywhere anymore. Jeez. Oh, yes, sir. W9, look at that. And got us a peak. Yep, yep. Anywho. Yeah. Gonna be one of these days. You know how you feel it, boy. Look at that W9. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And maybe I should have stayed in my parking spot and walked my lazy ass over here to the pump. Good God. I didn't think it'd be like this this early in the morning. Man. Yeah, there's a spot here to get into. Yep, yep. Oh, look at the lights on that truck there. Yes, sir, look at all the lights. Yep, yep. I don't have all this too much. Alright, folks. It's time to go to work. Yep, yep. Walk around all I can walk around. But let's go, let's go. There's a close up. Put a one with the lights. Yep, yep. There you go, there you go. And we got another one back in right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, now we got to get on up out of here. You know, I couldn't get what I wanted to drink. I wanted... Well, I knew they wasn't going to have no Mountain Dew Code Red in there, so... I wasn't even going after that. I was going after regular Mountain Dew, but they didn't have it, so... Ended up with Pepsi. Bark's root beer was out, but I, I get that a lot. But, yeah. Anyhow, it's time to go to work. Yep, yep. Hey, I almost couldn't remember. I had to think of where the hell am I at? Oh, yeah, I'm in Alabama. Or Mississippi. Yeah, uh, Lake Mississippi, so. Like, where am I headed? <laughs> uh, he throws them eggs on me in the middle of my. My, uh, 
and time out messes everything up. But, oh well, got to see something different for a couple days. Boy, they just parked everywhere. Man. I mean, I park on ramps too, but jeez, they deep on this ramp. Uh huh. All right, here we go. Here we go. Whoop whoop, trucking up, trucking up. Hey, right, folks, yeah, we in Jackson. I had to stop and get me some Red Bull. I was trying to go without it, but. Yeah, I guess I'll have it. <laughs> well, no, you can't have Red Bull withdrawals. But anyhow, yeah, I knew I wanted it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, I'll get back with y'all. Turn right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at that pier built there. That's what I'm talking about. Yep. Another magnetic plate on the back of my phone coming off. I don't know what the hell's going on with these plates anymore. They don't want to stick to my phone. Well, it's a brand new one, so can't say it's done lost its glue because it's brand new. But anywho, it is what it is. If I have to buy some more later, I'll buy some more. I probably have to put one on the inside of my case. I don't know why though. I mean, I've had this phone two years and now all of a sudden I'm having problems with shit sticking it. Not cool, not cool. Anywho, we're getting back on the big road. Well, we have 420 miles before we get to Dallas. And then, uh, yeah. And then we'll go on to Waco, probably spend the night in Waco. Turn left at the traffic light, then exit right. But anywho, all right. So here we go, folks, here we go. It's a hard turn here if you turn white, I mean. Take the exit. If you ain't careful right, right here, you end up over there. Toward Vicksburg. At the Petro. Yep, yep. 30 miles, folks, 30 miles, and we'll be crossing over that uh, mighty Mississippi River. Yeah, yeah. And then, uh, we'll be in Louisiana. That's right, Louisiana. Let's go, let's go. All right, I want you folks to see this. This is the worst thing y'all can do to a driver. You see that? Dude's just hanging out there. Right there at the end of my trailer, just hanging out there with his lights in my mirror, and it's steady blinding me. If I look that way at all, I get that. You see? Y'all don't see nothing either. All I gotta do is look that way, and it blinds the hell out of me. So, here y'all, the only thing I can do is slow down and let them go because they don't want to go nowhere. See now, we can see again. Yeah. Give them a taste of their own medicine. The lights in their beer. Uh huh. Anywho. Alright. Alright, folks, there it is. The big white cross here on my route. Those of you who've been following for a while, y'all know where I'm at. Yep, yep. Of course, it's Louisiana, but what part of Louisiana? I'll give you a second here to get Okay, well, whatever. Anyhow, it is Rayville, Louisiana. Yep, yep. 
That is Rayville. When you see that, you know I'm in Rayville, man. It's not the only cross on my path, but that's the biggest. And they have some other ones, but they're not real big like that. But anywho. Yep, and we got 320 miles to go, folks. 320. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Got a big old Kenworth here. Yep, yep, old 660. Yeah, five miles, folks. Five miles. Oh, look at the Kenworth Road. I had me a couple of those. A couple of that model. I had two of them that model, but my uh, thing is a Jennifer. The older model, like the 85 Camaro, 85 to 86. I had three of those. Yep, yep. Anywho, I'll get back with y'all here shortly. Alright, alright, folks, here we are. Exiting here. Taking a 30 minute break and. Take the ramp ahead. Who knows? I know I want to get some fresh drink. Let's see what else I can get into while I'm here. Look at up, Pete. Yeah, look at old bull wagon. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Comes another one. Look at that one. Yep, yep. Oh, here's an old one. Yeah, that's old school. We got a call by that red line. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at old flat top Kenworth. Yep, yep. That's what I'm talking about. Place pretty busy this morning. It'd be eight o'clock in the morning here. Jeez. Yeah, buddy. But anywho, yeah, I got. Crazy. That truck looking sharp. Hi, right, folks. I stopped. I ain't staying here for no 30 minute break. The rain is moving in. I went inside long enough to get a drink. My two meat pies. Now it's time to roll. I got time on the clock to make Dallas. So I might as well go before the rain moves in and ruins my truck. As long as I stay ahead of it, I should be good. Yep, yep. Let's just see if I can stay ahead of it. We're going to see. As of right now, it's on me. Yep, yep. I'm going to take the shortcut. Yes, sir. You go all the way around the truck. Left, oh, then take the baby, first I'll right. be lucky to catch the light. Before it Turn goes left, red. Yeah, I think I made it, right. folks. Turn left, then take the first and I really need to buy a lotto ticket. That's, that's twice something good happened to me in the past couple days. Normally, my luck. I get caught at every red light I come to. I see here's another one turning green on me. Yes, sir. What a deal. Oh, oh, oh. That's real bumpy. Yep, yep. Traffic 
flight. All right, folks. Well, yep, here we go. Another green light. I'm trying to keep from using the windshield wipers. That's why I hadn't yet. I don't want to. Right now, all that little bit of water would do is smear the bugs on the window. I don't want to do that yet. That's why I haven't cleaned the windshield. Because I don't want to smear them. Now let some more rain build up. Let the water sit there for a minute and soften them up, then they'll wipe right away. But for right now, eh, we're not going to do nothing. Let the rain sit there. Yep, yep. All right, folks. Well, we're 218 miles from Dallas. Three hours and 20 minutes is what it's saying. I got hours and uh, 10 minutes before I have to do a 30. I was just going to take my 30 early, but I don't know. It seems like I'm running to the rain. I might be. I looked at the radar earlier. I didn't see nothing on the radar. Continue on I-20. But, yeah, it's obvious it's raining. Yeah. Well, anywho, it is what it is. I got two days out of the clean truck. Yeah, I guess that's all right. so muddy here. I mean, there's like, I wipe the windows, it's like wiping mud. Yeah. Huh. I don't know. That's weird. Well, there ain't no water on the road, so no, nothing up on the windshield. You know, if that's the case, I'd say it's coming from the road, but there ain't no spray coming off the road yet. The road ain't wet enough, but yet it's not clean like uh, uh, Oh well, anyhow. Anywho, it's all good. Rambling on about nothing. <laughs> who cares if the rain dirty, dirty water on the window? Who, who cares? I know. Anywho, we'll get back to regular trucking now. Well, here's the end of the clean truck. Yep. That'll be getting over spray and shit. Yeah, my truck will be dirty now for sure. Oh, well. It is what it is. Only 79 degrees out there this morning. Oh, big boat, big boat. Yep. I know 
they get done doing that piece going through Shreveport, they need to come on and uh, redo 220. For it taking a beat and the whole time they was working on 20, they need to redo 220 now. is taking on a lot more traffic here recently than normal, so, yeah. Anywho, all right. Well, oh, whoa, oh, easy. Careful, careful. <laughs> hazards on for three miles now. I don't know what this dump truck is doing. But he damn sure ain't going too fast at it. They 
maybe just controlling traffic through here. Who knows? There's a lot of traffic I gotta get across to get all the way over to that exit on the other side. And I gotta get through. Oh, oh yeah, there's a truck there. Thank you. He blocked it off for me. Take exit 479A on the right to US 175 West. Thank you, CFI. All right. Now we're going this way. We'll be seeing downtown Dallas here soon, folks. Yep, 29 miles away, 29 miles. Let's go, let's go. Oh, oh, big bumps, big bumps. Yep, bump, bump, put it up, bump, bump, bump. All right. Now. Yeah, if you look way off in the distance where y'all can't see it on the camera, but way up there, you see the Dallas skyline. Yep, yep, but we'll get there soon. Thanks, Tracy. You want to fucking push my damn truck over? Oh, sorry, folks. Here we are, coming into downtown Dallas. Yep, yep. Here we go. Here we go. Downtown. There's me a thumbnail. Yep. Take exit two eighty six A on uh, toward I thirty five A North. Yeah. What a deal. Well, they flying down through here. Make me feel like I'm going slow. I'm doing fifty five. These fools are running seventy. Well, I can see. I ain't in that big a hurry. I left in plenty enough time this morning. I did not need to be running 70 through downtown. Yep, yep. Anywho. Oh, I hate this bridge. Lord, I just don't like it. It's the inside lane. You know why? Because we're already, we're leaning to the left. And I'm looking straight down in the dirt when I'm on that inside lane or the, the road below me <laughs> and some dirt. I just don't like it. I don't like it. But yeah, here we are, folks. We fixed to be going through the tunnel. Yeah, they even got the water going up here to the little water park they got on top of the tunnel here. It ain't that hot. Well, it's 90 degrees here. I guess it is still hot. Yeah, it's better than 110 it was a couple days ago. But anyhow, yep, I need to work my way over. 
so let's go. We got us a Lone Star back there. Lone Star Trucking, thank you. You, you helped us all out. Now, I think I need one more lane, but we'll figure that out here shortly. Ooh, getting dark here in the tunnel. I like get the sun out my eyes. Now my eyes got to readjust. All right, all right, here we are getting on the 35E, folks. 35E, yeah, we was on that bridge over there the other day. Yep, yep. All right. Now, jeez. Okay, now we need to get all the way to the left lane. And after this one SUV, I got it all the way to the left. In four miles, keep left to Texas 180. Oh, hang out right here for the rest of the way through here. All right, folks, I'll get back with y'all. We get closer. We are 14 miles away. All right, folks, all right, we are. Nine miles away, nine miles. Folks, all right, folks, we're one mile from the exit. I'm going to go on. I'm running low on storage, so I'm going to go on and uh, stop this video here. You made it this far. Thanks for watching. TTBE. Bye for now.